so hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel and hope you guys are doing well and today we are going to do the technical analysis of polka dot guys guys when last time crypto crashed when the price was over the support line of five dollars guys everybody was bearish for the price of polka dot and guys i have told you that we are going to see a recovery in the market and that's that's how we move from five dollars support line all the way up to six dollars and 62 cents a resistance line guys this is how i'm predicting the market so perfect let you guys appreciate my technical analysis guys make sure to subscribe to my channel and for next price targets guys stay with me till the end of this video so guys at the time of recording this video the price of paul Carter is facing the resistance around six dollars and sixty uh, cents guys and you guys can see that we are forming a red four hour candle guys at this resistance level and uh, this is something that's more obvious and more important to see because we are facing the resistance around this level and if we broke over this resistance line guys definitely we'll be moving all the way up to seven dollars but guys what's more important for now that how we recover from that pullback guys when the price was all the way over the support line of five dollars guys and then we gain a uh, recovery in the market guys but we if we look at in a one hour time frame for paul Cardot, guys you guys can see that how beautifully we retested every single rejection and support line guys and uh, every single resistance you guys can see when we move over and we broke below the resistance level of five dollars and 74 cents guys we move all the way up to the support line of five dollars guys and then we retested that rejection we get rejected and then we move over the resistance of five dollars 74 cent guys then we start moving all the way guys over the resistance line of six dollars and 40 cents guys and then we get rejected and we move all the way up to five dollars and 74 cents again guys and now we are seeing recovery in the market but what's more important for now that how strong this recovery is and we are facing the resistance level of six dollars and 60 cents guys and uh, what's more important for now guys that what's going to happen in the immediate short term but guys before moving to the technicals and before letting you guys know what's going to happen let's look at the market first and you guys can see that we are on a recovery at the time of recording this video the price of paul Cardot is six dollars and 63 cents and we are up about 19 percent this week guys and that's because of a crypto surge and let's look at the fair and green meter for paul Cardot. it's on a buy position guys but let me warn you for now that it should not be on a buy position and you guys have to be more careful for now because the we have already seen a recovery in the market and you guys can see that guys this resistance around six dollars and sixty cents is something that's more important for the price of paul Cardot, guys important thing is that if you move over this resistance line guys definitely the next target is seven dollars guys that's more obvious for now and this is what i am looking up for the price of paul carter but guys let me tell you uh, let me give you a bigger scenario guys that when we move from five dollars guys all the way guys up to six dollars and 40 cents over this resistance line guys we broke all the way up to five dollars and 74 cents and now we are moving to this part and if we get over this resistance line the next target will be the seven dollars resistance line guys but what's more important for now that what's going to happen after that guys what's going to happen after that guys when we move all the way when we will move all the way up to the resistance line of seven dollars guys if we move over the point is if we move over this resistance line the next target is definitely seven dollars guys if we move to the resistance line of seven dollars guys what's going to happen uh, after that guys for me what's going to happen after that guys is that if we move all the way up to seven dollars guys the next price target for that will be we will definitely see a pullback in the market and the pullback will be kind of that we will definitely again move all the way up to five dollars and 74 cents support level guys this is something that i'm looking up for the market when the price will reach the resistance line guys when the price will reach the resistance line of seven dollars guys i am about to short paul Carlot at that point because that will be the best opportunity for us to make money guys out of the market this is something that's more important guys and uh, let me tell you something that why i'm so obvious guys why i'm so obvious and uh, this is how we will continue the down track we will retest every single support every support will turn into a resistance and we will all the way up to five dollars and 74 cents and even we can break over this resistance line and why i'm so obvious about that let me tell you something let me show you an indicator that's rsi guys you guys can see that relative strength index and uh, let me tell you that why i'm so obvious that last time when you move all the way up to six dollars and forty cents over the resistance line of six dollars and forty cents guys you guys can see that the rsi move over the 70 mark guys and now we are again almost almost 
at the level guys when it's considered to be overbought guys uh, this is the level guys almost at 70 mark and you guys can see when previously previously when we moved to this part when the price was overbought you guys can see a sell signal last time guys and now we are again at this point that we are definitely overbought on rsi guys and uh, if we move at least like if we move over the 70 mark guys this is what i'm looking up for the market will definitely move somehow we will be more oversold guys at this position then definitely will start to pull back up from that price but that will be the point because if you have missed that these buy signals when we move from five dollars all the way up to the seven dollars mark guys so you have missed the train guys that's something that's more important you guys have to think about it that uh, if you have guys have missed that level do you if you guys have missed that trade and if you guys have missed my call last time so you guys have to wait for the next time then when we will see a pullback in the market so you guys will short the polka dot guys and you guys will short the polka dot and then you guys can make a money out of the market on this level guys that's something that what i'm looking up for the market guys and this is something that's most realistic but let me tell you something and as long as we are above the resistance line sorry the support line of six dollars guys we can move that there is a kind of a bullish scenario for the price of paul card and even we can break to this part and then we can start continue to all the way up to seven dollars guys but as i've told you that this resistance line is the strongest resistance line for polka dot guys and if you guys appreciate my technical analysis guys make sure to subscribe to my channel because it's the best technical and the most realistic technical analysis on youtube guys so subscribe and hit the bell icon and as always until next time